to wrap Tim Wire. Make some noise! Yeah. Right, our next battle, we've got yeah. Average Keith! Yeah. 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 Facing, this is your debut, isn't it? It's, your first, it's his first ever battle, so you know, make some noise for his first ever battle, give him some confidence. Yeah. Yeah. Body you want to go first? Yeah. Right. Average Keith to go first. So what I'm going to do is I'm not really going to call time. It's up to them. So when they're finished, I'll feel fine with that. Okay? Okay. Cheers. <laughs> Who the fuck is this pupil of a pedo? Why has substance been replaced by a plug from the Beano? <laughs> Man, get onto the state of you. Even a gay rapist wouldn't rape you. <laughs> You've got no style of substance or even stamina. You mint so much, you should be put in a lasagna. <laughs> this guy looks like a hybrid prototype. He has a likeness to a slightly masculine transvestite. <laughs> Have you ever heard the saying, unprotected sex is a dodgy path to tread? Yet he still regards licking jizzy dicks as the best thing since sliced bread. <laughs> substance, you lack it. You certainly don't pack it. The alcoholic variety gets me twatted. Substance, you smell of. Catch it. <laughs> Just a plastic scally against a fake woolly back. He'll rob my wallet keys phone, but still be inclined to give me cash back. <laughs> now, I can tell he's a virgin trying to chase dirty skets. He's such a fucking stick, he should work in CEX. <laughs> that young man of Golden Square with the emos after the knob. You look like the gormless kid who didn't quite make Blazing Squad. <laughs> I put you in your place to get back in position. You've as much confidence in your system as depressed rape victim. You're a recluse who get lyrically battered and bruised. I can see the busies forming outside because this is substance abuse. Time. <laughs> Right, next round of substance! I'm thinking he's done because he just said I'm in lasagna only because I'm mincing this cunt. <laughs> First, yo, so I'm gonna put this filth in a box like the judges did to justice because Wilson was Bob. I bet his mood went down like the pills that you dropped when a bad decision gave you the only win that you've got. Fuck the acapellas, I just want to speak down on beats now because I could spit three rounds of tree sounds and still expose the average as an overstatement. Go away and keep out. <laughs> yo, and I'm hitting critical so take a sec to analyse the blow and if you sniff then you may be a about to like the show because half your rhymes a joke plus your flows in a heap on the table Tony Montana's line of coke <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, when I woke up in your mother's bed I told her I don't I could I told her just to put her head back on my cock and suck until it's looking like another leg last time she checked it it erected to a foot in length and I had the bitch on every inch of my snake like I turned the slut into a bed <laughs> And in both your last battles you've questioned intelligence, so I'll take the concept of intellectual intellect and embellish it. Because everything you say makes you a half-truth rhyme. I write bars over jokes you just can't do either. Whoa! <laughs> Seriously, what can he do to me? The soft twat looks like he hasn't even hit puberty. <laughs> yeah, I'll admit I'm not hit with the ladies, that'd be no shitting. At least I can make an orgasm in any position. You can only do that when you bought my new kitchen. <laughs> well, don't sound like smart, you'll get the occasional strop. I'll talk to you about the birds, bees, ladies, but for now you'll have to accumulate your fantasies on a sock. <laughs> I hear he loves gymnastics, but one day in practice, his face at the floor. The result, he looks like a spastic. <laughs> now, we all know paper boy jobs are not much of a career. Well, I've heard the Saturday jobs going in, as the I got sparring Ike here. <laughs> you don't want to end up on the dole. Get down connections, I've heard they're doing apprenticeships in stock control. <laughs> this partly had me pissed off, since when did battle rap start accepting ex goths <laughs> How can this guy even get near any honeys? For fuck's sake, man, he's still collected pocket money. <laughs> <laughs> so seriously consider your options. Maybe quit rapping. Were you conceived on a motorway? Because that's where most accidents happen. <laughs> <laughs> Here are good, but you prefer wine. There's only one barrier for you though, challenge 25. <laughs> Next round of substance. Yo, I'm not into losing to faggots. Telling me I'm on the dole. You turned up in Reebok classics. <laughs> <laughs> Time 
time to me, time for me to go in hard and expose those mediocre bars because I'm so precise. It's like performing surgery on open hearts. If these people want to hear my shit again, I'll keep some jokes in jars and cut your hands off. So roll in a spliff. The only time you roll with arms. <laughs> And he's got the swagger of a guy you get in line just to speak. You're all written, you couldn't freestyle to a beat. I'll flow some more to make the rising tides what I speak. Put your jaw on the floor like you can't take your eyes off of me. Because the rhymes that I breathe are a sign of the greed that's taking my life like a siege. But when I rise with the breeze, you couldn't sigh for me. I'll rip your style with ease because you're not wild or freeze or ill. You're a mild disease. Yeah, it is. Oh. And you burnt a proper slimy bitch. <laughs> bet that she'd be happy with a line of pigs, five odd dips, chocolate, and a pint of chips. <laughs> I bet you're always crying with the size that her vagina is. The embarrassing thing is she'd be happy with a five inch dip. <laughs> yeah, time. <laughs> He acts hard, but he ain't scaring me. He turns up the playgrounds out to the teeth with their relief. <laughs> I can guarantee I can find a playmate. You saved your breath, you need it to blow up your date. <laughs> now, stop with the weak bars with shit lines to drop. You look like the original Mr. Muscle who took the world's biggest cum shot. <laughs> now, people told me he's sick, saying Keith, he's ill, bro. But the only illness he gets is from a bacteria when he sucks on his Mars dildo. <laughs> Outcast of the family, your life be a bitch. I found you a new one though, say hello to the orphanage. <laughs> <laughs> His mum's such a slag, a rapist had a chloroform rag. She said, no need for that lad, I'm gagging for a shag. <laughs> <laughs> she got pulled by a footy team, come all, come in. They gang banged and it was similar to throwing sweet corn in an industrial side bin. <laughs> <laughs> I quit with the my jokes, he doesn't sound. What's more funny is he looks like Peter Crouch with Downs. He washed off his boss just to get three days leave, talking so much shit because he sucks on used anal beads. He comes in here acting aggy like he be the meanest. You ain't the strongest, the fastest sperm, but fair play on swerving the Kleenex. <laughs> Here you were for a shit beer company in Carlsberg and support West Ham. You fake cockney twat! And guess what? You ain't got shit on Millwall fans. <laughs> <laughs> I squirt bars, this is like West Ham's performance because I'm 3 0 up in the first half. Oh. Oh. And Keith better tell the guy a par next to pray because I've killed you in three and I only memorised my bars yesterday. Oh. <laughs> and my flow's hardest, he's so tarnished because I've got a witness to prove that this shit is true and it's Joe Garbett. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, so watch him getting burned still. I've got an infected verse ill. You couldn't spit fresh if you ingested Persil. <laughs> <laughs> and your punchlines have all the impact of rain that hits me and you give away shit that literally made me diss Keith. I want my views going huge on the tube until I'm making history the AV to put him in ER until his age hits 50. Oh, oh, nice. nice. Uh, and, um, fucking... This shit is, uh, this is the gruesome shit, because he's put himself in too deep, just like Whitney Houston did. <laughs> um, I'm rapping this shit fresh, just because people think you've got balls, you're not a celebrity, you're just fat in my whip bread. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I don't know. Substance was had more presence. Average Keith was more consistent. Substance was good with his flips. Fuck it. Substance on the fact that it's his first battle and it was 50-50 and Average Keith has the advantage of more experience, so I'll give it to Substance. Oh no, mate. Substance. Okay. First battle, Brian. Substance. Billy had his flows on lockdown. Memorised perfect. Average Keith. The list goes bars. Ripped Substance. The pieces for Substance. Still on the first debut of the battle. Substance. I give it to Substance as well. It's his first battle and the flips he brought were fucking hilarious. I mean, uh, I'm a bars over jokes person. The Substance hit everyone with bars. This crowd just didn't react and they should have. He had some great bars, so Substance. Can you make some noise to that ball? Yeah! yeah. The winner is 3-0 again.
and it's going to substance. Yeah. Yeah.